Well, that's the problem. The James Webb Space Telescope is upsetting the apple cart. All of a sudden, we realize... In James Webb's images, we see a collection of objects that have left scientists scratching their heads. These items are so peculiar and ancient, they defy easy explanation. Many of them are intricately structured, making it improbable that they are newly formed galaxies from just 300 or 400 million years after the Big Bang. Scientists initially anticipated discovering star clusters that might contain what are known as Population 3 stars. These stars, believed to have been massive and radiant, had short lifespans. However, the surprises didn't end there. James Webb's observations revealed a galaxy with such low luminosity that it doesn't fit the expected profile of star clusters containing bright supergiants. Even more astonishing was the discovery of six black holes that were already immense just 500 million years after the Big Bang. This raises profound questions about where all the matter came from to fuel their rapid growth. According to previous models of cosmology, it typically takes billions of years for galaxies or black holes to evolve into the forms that James Webb is now revealing to us. The James Webb Telescope, with an estimated range of approximately 13.5 billion years, doesn't represent a quantum leap beyond its predecessor, the Hubble Telescope. However, what sets Webb apart is its ability to peer more deeply into space and discern finer details. Our quest for understanding has led us to remarkable discoveries. While the Hubble Space Telescope unveiled the ancient GNZ 11 galaxy dated at around 13.4 billion years old, the James Webb Space Telescope has pushed our boundaries further. It has unveiled a multitude of galaxies hidden in the depths of space, some exhibiting astonishing redshifts of up to Z20. Among these celestial marvels, 15 galaxies have been definitively identified, sparking intense scientific curiosity to unravel their mysteries. These distant galaxies come into view through the remnants of their emitted light. Telescopes act as cosmic time machines, capturing this ancient light and transporting us back in time. Through this cosmic lens, we gain vivid glimpses of the universe's infancy, witnessing its primordial state billions of years ago. Beyond light, another cosmic relic guides our understanding, the cosmic background radiation. This pervasive cosmic microwave background radiation, a relic from the universe's early days, blankets the cosmos uniformly. Discovered accidentally in 1965 by American physicists Arno Penzias and Robert Wilson, this cosmic whisper was initially perceived as a mysterious noise in space. Today, it stands as a crucial messenger from a distant cosmic era. Gigantic radio telescopes intercept this faint microwave signal, emanating from every direction across the celestial sphere. This cosmic echo carries ancient messages from distant cosmic events, echoing the birth pangs of the cosmos itself. Its discovery not only confirmed the Big Bang Theory, but also reinforced our understanding of the universe's continuous expansion. The mysteries of background radiation. The background radiation we detect today is like a snapshot of the universe's early days, taken around 380,000 years post Big Bang. At that time, the cosmos started emitting light, although it was a slow process. This radiation doesn't allow us to see all the way back to the Big Bang itself but it's a crucial piece in piecing together the puzzle of our universe's infancy. Imagine this radiation as a treasure trove for scientists. It holds clues about the composition, density, and temperature of the early universe. By studying cosmic background radiation, scientists can unlock a wealth of information about how the universe evolved over time. One fascinating aspect is how scientists can analyze cosmic structures and even tiny fluctuations in their distribution. These small variations contain a wealth of data, like reading thousands of complex details in a cosmic storybook. These observations have been instrumental in shaping our understanding of the universe through various cosmological models. However, as with any scientific endeavor, new discoveries often lead to new questions. Today, researchers are delving into the latest mysteries of light. 
They are exploring phenomena like shining galaxies and the dazzling glow of dust disks surrounding black holes. These phenomena, once thought of as distant mystery, are now within the reach of scientific exploration. Radio astronomers are tuning in to the whispers of the universe to uncover its deepest secrets. They use the cosmic background radiation as a time capsule, attempting to eavesdrop on events that occurred eons ago, seeking clues to the universe's early days. One astonishing discovery that many might not know about is the detection of ancient galaxies. This quest accelerated during the James Webb era, starting in 2016. A team led by Pascal Osh and Garth D. Illingworth made a groundbreaking find using the Hubble Space Telescope. They identified a galaxy with a redshift of Z equal to 11.09, dubbed GNZ 11. This redshift indicates that the light from GNZ 11 traveled for over 13 billion years before reaching Hubble's keen eyes. GNZ 11 holds the title of the most distant known galaxy, capturing the imagination of scientists worldwide. What makes GNZ 11 particularly intriguing is not just its immense distance, but also its unique characteristics. Despite its youth in cosmic terms, GNZ 11 shines brightly and boasts significant size. When we observe GNZ 11, only around 400 million years have passed since the Big Bang. This makes GNZ 11 one of the oldest galaxies from our perspective, yet it was still in its infancy at that time, displaying remarkable development. The formation of complex galaxies like GNZ 11 is a slow, intricate process that takes billions of years. GNZ 11 boasts an estimated mass of about 1 billion solar masses, and a star formation rate of approximately 20 solar masses per year. These numbers highlight its unexpectedly rapid evolution and activity, challenging conventional theories about galaxy formation and evolution. This discovery opens a window into the early universe, offering insights into the cosmic timeline and the mechanisms driving galaxy formation and growth. JWST's glimpse into the early universe. In 2016, Observing and analyzing GNZ 11 presented a formidable technological challenge. The light emitted from this galaxy was not only incredibly faint, but also heavily shifted into the red spectrum. This extreme redshift pushed the capabilities of the Hubble Space Telescope to their limits. At that time, researchers were intrigued by this unusual find, although GNZ 11 was just one of many galaxies and considered somewhat exotic. Fast forward to today, and we've come to realize that the early universe was teeming with highly organized and massive galaxies like GNZ 11. The James Webb Space Telescope, launched into space, has been a game changer in unraveling these cosmic mysteries. Its advanced capabilities have revealed a wealth of new discoveries, challenging the established notions of what the early galaxies and stars looked like. One such groundbreaking find is Jada's GSZ-111, a high-redshift Lyman Brake galaxy detected by the James Webb Space Telescope on September 29, 2022. This galaxy's redshift value of 13 indicates that it existed roughly 13.4 billion years ago, a mere 400 million years after the Big Bang. Only the James Webb Space Telescope with its specially designed observation techniques, could capture the faint light from this incredibly distant galaxy. The discoveries made possible by JWST are reshaping our understanding of the early universe. What was once considered a remote and mysterious time is now becoming clearer thanks to the relentless pursuit of knowledge and the cutting-edge technology at our disposal. You see, in astronomy, there's a fascinating phenomenon called redshift that happens in the infrared range. It's all about how light from stars or galaxies shifts towards longer red wavelengths. This shift is closely tied to the expansion of the universe, making it a crucial concept in understanding the cosmos. The main reason for redshift is likely the universe's expansion. Imagine the universe as a balloon being inflated. 
As it expands, everything inside, including light, stretches along with it. This stretching of light waves towards longer wavelengths, like stretching a rubber band, is what causes redshift. But there are other factors at play too. Sometimes, the movement of objects in a gravitational field can also cause redshift. It's like how a car's horn sounds different as it approaches you versus when it moves away. This effect is known as the Doppler effect. In astronomy, it means that if a light source is moving relative to an observer, its light gets shifted towards the red end of the spectrum. A window into galactic origins. The discovery of redshift dates back to the early 20th century, when astronomers like Vesto Slipher and later Edwin Hubble noticed this shift in light from distant galaxies. Hubble's observations were groundbreaking. He found that the farther a galaxy is from Earth, the greater its redshift. This led to the development of the Hubble Law, which not only tells us about galaxies' distances and movements, but also forms the basis of the expanding universe theory. Now, let's dive into a specific example that adds a twist to our understanding. Enter Sears 2112, a barred spiral galaxy that adds a bit of confusion to the mix. Despite not being as ancient as galaxies like GNZ11 or Jade's Z13, which have redshift values of Z equals 3, Sears 2112 is still a puzzle. It's almost a twin of our Milky Way, which is intriguing in itself. Typically, spiral galaxies take billions of years to form. But Sears 2112 seems to have formed much faster, possibly in just 2 billion years. Its high redshift tells us that it existed at a time when the universe was a bit older, but still very young in cosmic terms. The galaxy known as SE 2112 is a colossal structure in the cosmos, with a stellar mass estimated to be about 3.9 billion times that of our Sun. This remarkable mass suggests that SE 2112 was already well developed when the universe was merely 2 billion years old. This fact it poses intriguing questions. How could a galaxy amass such significant mass and intricate structure so rapidly after the Big Bang? Typically, galaxies evolve over billions of years. Yet here, we have SE 2112, seemingly defying this slow progression. We are faced with a puzzle. The galaxies we observe, which appear to be youthful at a mere few hundred million to two billion years old, must actually be much older. This implies they existed even before the Big Bang, challenging our understanding of cosmic timelines. Several theories attempt to unravel this mystery. One suggests that the universe is far older than we currently believe. The James Webb Telescope's astonishing discoveries have prompted us to reconsider the age of the universe. A theory proposed by Canadian Indian researcher Rendra Gupta offers an explanation. He posits that the universe is expanding, and as light travels through space, it tires or loses energy. If this is true, it could mean that our measurements of cosmic distances have been incorrect all along. Another theory proposes that the universe has no beginning. While the Big Bang theory is widely accepted, it is not without its doubts. Only the universe's expansion and the cosmic microwave background radiation seem to support it. However, quantum mechanics offers clues that the universe might be infinite in both time and space. A third possibility is that our universe had a different origin. Beyond the traditional view of the universe expanding from a single point, there are numerous other theories about how our cosmos came to be. One such idea is that the universe is nourished by multiple sources, which may not have all originated simultaneously. Whether the universe is much older than we thought, has no beginning, or had a different inception, these galaxies, like SE 2112, serve as cosmic puzzles, pushing the boundaries of our knowledge and imagination. Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button and subscribe for more mind-blowing discoveries.